crackers, a cute notebook with scrambled eggs, a cactus with needles inside, and a bright pencil case shaped like Skittles? Today, we will tell you how to make mini office supplies that can be used like the real thing. For the first light pack, you need a piece of a metal can. Cut out a small square. Fold it and cut out a piece like this. Cut off the excess and get two identical blades. Cross them and fasten the ends with masking tape. Punch a hole with an awl. Insert a piece of wire and press it using pliers. Take a piece of modeling clay. Cover both ends with circles of modeling clay. Use a box cutter to give the handles the right shape. Make holes in the center. You get mini scissors! Despite their size and how fragile they are, they can really cut things. They obviously can't handle a lot of work, but they can definitely cut a fringe out of paper. You just need to be careful. The edges of the blades are very sharp. Next, take a cork from a bottle. Cut off the narrow leg. Paint the cork red. Take pins and pliers. Cut the pins in half. Fasten a tiny clay ball. Color over the top with a black marker. Take green pom-poms. Fasten them to the cork with pins. The result is a cactus with funny round branches. Stick the pins into pom-poms. Bright cactuses made out of pom-poms are a useful pincushion and a cute decoration. And now you need a Ziploc bag. Cut two pieces like these out of plastic. Glue them together with super glue on both sides. Glue on a magnet. Coat the walls with glue and pour sparkles inside. Fasten another magnet on the other side. Coat the edges with glue. Tuck in the lower part. Close the envelope with the magnets. Decorate with a gold half bead. The result is a glamorous folder for mini school supplies. The clutch protects soft notebook covers and adds a little shine to them. For another idea, you need a piece of cardboard. Draw a freeform figure with a simple pencil. Cut it out. Make two pieces. Cut out figures of the same shape from a white foam rubber sheet. Place the cardboard between the foam rubber sheet parts. Hot glue it on. Decorate with a circle of a yellow foam rubber sheet. Punch a hole with an awl. Cut out papers following the egg-shaped piece. Combine the papers and the egg using a metal ring. Draw a smile on the yolk on one side and a sad face on the other. You will be the only one with a bright and original notebook like this. Your classmates will definitely notice. Looks delicious and very funny. For this life hack, you need a regular calendar. Cut it by months. Take some scrapbook paper. Glue a month on the paper. Do the same with the rest of the year. Fasten the sheet with a clip and make a number of holes in the upper part. Take a piece of cardboard and bend it like this. With the help of metal rings, hook the calendar on the cardboard. For convenience, you can use pliers. Glue the cardboard base. The result is a small desk calendar. It doesn't take up much space on your desk and is very convenient to use. For another idea, take a cap from a glue stick. Take a piece of clay and make a long roll. Fold it in half and twist it in a spiral. Next, take pieces of white and pink clay. Form triangular ears. Fasten a horn between them. Sculpt the bangs from thin strips of clay. Fasten them to the horn. Decorate the glue cap with it. Fasten eyes and round nostrils. Look at this beautiful and comfortable stand for mini office supplies. A cute unicorn can be a fun souvenir for a friend or a classmate. And now we'll tell you how you can use old plastic pipettes. 
Trim a pipette from both sides. You will need only the middle part. Seal the wide edge with a flat iron through a layer of parchment paper. Take some foam rubber sheet. Mark the same diameter of the pipette. Cut out one circle following the markup and another one a little larger. Glue the pieces together. Try on the cork. It's very secure. Fill the plastic bottle with paint. Close it. Make a lot of these bottles and pour paint into each of them. Now you have a whole set of tubes of paint for making your first mini masterpiece. And to feel like a real artist, you can use our next light pack. You need a piece of cardboard. Draw a palette with a simple pencil. Cut it out along the outline. Cover the palette with white acrylic paint. Squeeze out paints. Every artist's most crucial tool is ready to go. You can mix colors to whatever shade you want, even on such a tiny palette. Now your favorite activity will be even more fun, and your drawings will be even better and more professional. For the next life hack, print a mini notebook cover and tiny sheet music. Fold the sheets in half. Collect them as a brochure. Glue the blank sides of the sheets with a glue stick. Attach a cover to the sheets. Draw a treble clef with a marker on a small piece of plastic. Cut it out. Put the plastic in a preheated oven. The high temperatures make the plastic harden and decrease in size. Take the ink container from a ballpoint pen. Trim it. Paste the treble clef into it. Cut a straw to the length of the pen. Cut it lengthwise. Place the pen in the pink case and compress the plastic around it. This composer set will make you the top of your music class. For the next idea, cut out a square from thick white cardboard. Decorate it however you want. You can do some calligraphy or stick strips on it. Fasten a binder clip. Make a schedule smaller, then print it out. Attach it to the cardboard with the binder clip. Fasten a mini board for notes to the cork board. The schedule is always before your eyes and you can grab its mini version at any time. Very convenient. Now you need markers and pipettes. Cut off narrow edges from the pipettes. Pull out the rods from the marker using pliers. Insert the rod into the pipette. Hot glue the edge and attach a pink pom-pom to it. Color the cap with a black marker. The result is a set of small markers. They write exactly like real ones. For the next life hack, take a strip of a black foam rubber sheet and print out a small diary cover. Use super glue to attach the foam rubber sheet to the cover. Glue the cover to the spine of the notebook. Use a hot glue gun. Trim the excess. Look at this cute miniature notepad. Its size is perfect. It can record a lot of necessary information and even fit in the smallest pocket. And for this craft, you need a printed Skittles label and a zipper. Strengthen the paper label with wide tape. Smooth it out to get rid of bubbles. Fold it in half. Glue the side parts with tape. Shorten the zipper to the size of the label. Attach it with hot glue. The result is a very stylish and tasty pencil case for miniature pencils. With such a bright and unusual pencil case, we guarantee you'll feel the rainbow! Did you like our life hacks for miniature office supplies? Write in the comments which of these ideas you'll try out. Like this video, subscribe to this channel, and don't forget to click on the bell to keep up with the most brilliant ideas for school from Troom Troom Select.